Are you Stephanie Burgess? Who are you? You don't look like Sentinel. Name's Nomad. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Ghost Recon Breakpoint. Continuing on the episode 2 Deep State Adventure DLC. We've found out and discovered plenty in the last episode as we progressed further and interacted and accessed a mission with Sam Fish, although he didn't do much. At least this time he was with us. Um, it felt like a little bit disappointing, just like the one in Wildlands. At least we did a lot within the compound. It was very interactive and it have offered the same mechanics that, you know, the game has been offering since the release. And, uh, yeah, at least he was, at least he showed his presence and he was present in the whole mission as a whole. Um, and we got to find more about, we got to find out more about Midas and what came to be of him and who the strat strategist really is. Especially, we found out Trey Stone's real role in this whole operation, which is called Project Claw, the transhumanism project and how it will integrate as a new threat of Aurora. Now, folks, hopefully you've been enjoying this. Smash that thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I am here in Aurora right now to also access some dialogue so we can learn more about the investigations and the game as a whole and what this episode 2 offers in terms of side interactions and side dialogues. I've been including this since the start of the series and I'm going to keep including this. If you do want to skip, go right ahead. I do include this for the people that are very interested within the whole game story campaign, um, as am I, to be fair. So... I'm doing it for myself and those people out there. Ladies and gentlemen, with no further ado, like I said, subscribe if you're new to the channel and join the climb. Don't forget to hit that notification button so you can keep up to date with further Ghost Recon Breakpoint videos. And with no further ado, let's get on with this. We've got the preparation from the last episode. Let's uh, break camp. Let's explore here in Error 1 what we can. And let's check this out. Uh, Black Sheep, we got... Loads of more people. Before we do so, I'm going to show you how many people we've unlocked. If you remember, we've collected that. Uh, we retrieved that collectible, which showed us. Um, I think it was an investigate. Uh, I think it was an investigation or a collectible, which showed us the CIA, the Central Intelligence Blacklist, and it showed us these five people, four people, I think it was four people: Stephanie Burgess, uh, General Paxton, William Van Dyke, and Holly McKenzie. These are all are all system analysts, patent legal advice of refi a retired US Army general, entomologist, and system analyst. We've got all of these people which used to work for the Central Intelligence and also had their own and worked in their own branch of the government as a whole and are, are now our only leads and can provide, provide us further intel and leads on this case. Let's see who we can talk to um, to provide us further dialogues within the game. I think we can talk to Holt because he's the guy that handed us the whole mission at the start originally so let's quickly talk to him let's see what we can say to him or we can say to us let's check this out Midas's trail we can update him on uh Midas which is more than fine and more than fair since it's one of his teammates and pretty much brothers especially the relationship that all four had especially Weaver when Weaver died of course Holt was absolutely uh distraught by it as was I and as was Nomad and for the whole group. So Midas is yet to find out all of this that Weaver has, has passed away and that Holt is in bad condition. We can update Holt on Midas's trail and on Midas's current whereabouts and what happened to him and also about the strategist. So let's see what he has to say to him. This is going to be interesting, folks. All right. I've got good and bad news. How do you want it? <sighs> Give me the bad first. Midas is alive. He is? Uh, how, how is that bad? He's being held prisoner by someone called a strategist. And whatever he wants from Midas, he's not going to play nice to get it. We have to move fast. Back in the suck, they got someone from my team. Cut him up good, too. Hurt him. By the time we got to him, yeah, he didn't make it. You know, there's good news, too. Sam Fisher's in town. He's going to help us get Midas back. We've got some leads. We have to get him back, Nomad. You hear me? Whatever it takes. Yeah, whatever it takes. What do you think I'm doing? And then stop saying we. Because there's no we in this. You just sit on a goddamn bed, hand in whatever intel and you can goddamn hand me. You know what I'm saying? So shut up. Let me do my goddamn duty and my job. All right, let's keep this going. Let's see who else we can talk to. Later, brother. Later. Later. So cheesy. Okay, let's uh, head to Mad Shores. Probably update him that there's a new threat here on Aroa. Most likely he would want to know. If there's not, then uh, I'm quickly going to speak to you. Anyone and everyone around here in the row to check, uh, should I say here in everyone to check what they can say or have to say. And apart from that, 
then we'll travel to mission point and we'll choose the first person uh, from the central intelligence to interrogate on new leads of this operation. Let's check this out. What have you got for me, buddy? Homesteader situation now. That's, yeah. Homesteader situation now. How's everything been going? Classic shit sandwich. And we are the damn mustard. What now? After the epidemic, Sentinel stepped up attacks on our people. Now it looks like everyone's finally listening to me and coming to Arrow One. And that's bad. It is when we're nearly doubling the amount of people in here in just a few days. People are crammed in, restless, angry, spend most of my days stopping fights. Just remind them of the real enemy. They need you to lead them against Sentinel. First priority is keeping my people alive. Next is fighting Sentinel. I understand. You, can, you can't hide forever. We had deal, Mads. I'm going to go with... Uh, Wait a second. Is he talking about me? Because we had a deal, Mads. That's more like, uh, you got to keep me here, buddy. Um, you know, I've got no other place to go. I'm saving your, I'm saving your back here. I'm watching out for your back. You got to watch out for mine, you know? Um, I'm going to go... I, I, I mean... Technically, I've stopped the first threat, which is Goldie Walker. I am technically stopping the second one. This is all about the epidemic. This is all to do with the faction missions. You know, the where you have new Sentinel and new Mercs coming in from the actual Sentinel branch, and they do come in to terrorize the citizens of Aroa. Also, they have spread a epidemic. I think a pandemic or a virus or something like that. Um, I still have to access them and I do want to cover them for the channel at some point. But uh, yeah, so what should I do? You can't hide forever. We had a deal, man. I'm going to go with I understand. I understand. Think of it this way. Sooner we win, sooner you get out of this cave. You sure know how to tease me. Indeed. Okay. All right. Uh, we'll go and select one of these central CIA. And we'll see. We'll start from the left. We'll start with Stephanie Burgess. Follow Stephanie Burgess' lead about the uh, strategist. Reached Stephanie's neighborhood is in the Liberty Province, and we get the fourth action on top, and I'm guessing each individual set of missions here will give you one of the each individual set of armor or suit from the fourth action on uh, division, which will be Sam Fisher's goddamn suit or armor. So you'll get to wear it if you want to. I'm probably going to stick with the things I have because I'm looking goddamn smooth. All right, let's go. Pin it. Um, Liberty Province, we probably got a fast travel. And back we are. Right. Let's do this. I don't think I have to deploy bivouac since I've done that in Era 1 just before uh, interacting with the new peeps. Um, so let's just get to the mission point. How far is it? 800 meters? We can walk there. We can also explore, admire the environment since I absolutely love this map. I absolutely love this part of the map as well. Wildlands definitely have a larger and increased variety and extensive design in, in you know, increased amount of environments. In the amount of environments as a whole, but this one definitely has the details um, or further details and extensive details such as the shadowing, the textures, and within the environments as a whole. It's just much more beautiful, I gotta say. And it has it has a wide variety of, of you know, elements and environments in this one. Obviously not to a certain extent like Wild, Wildlands did. Wildlands map was, you know, its predecessor definitely offered a huge and larger map. But I think by shortening the map size and covering more details and focusing more on the details and the look of the environment, it was definitely worth it. And it definitely uh, made up for it, we could say. I mean, look at this. We went from a uh, little tropical rainforest to a normal forest to an open field of grass and it's still the same environment but obviously you got the snowy environment you got the snowy mountains they try to include the same kind of extensive uh, environments as wildlands obviously they obviously shortened it and made it they packed it all into a smaller map so it's still it's still it still gives me that kind of nostalgia from wildlands but it's much more beautiful right they don't have too many clowns here we can take one oroa just got more crowded Nine Missed my first shot. That was my bad. Sorry, folks. Deep Blue. I'm in Stephanie's neighborhood. You got any intel on her? Wait, what the hell is that? What did I just pick up? She's some sort of legal advisor from Silicon Valley. Specializing in patent law. Okay. Sure what brought her here, though. And why would Claw need a legal advisor? That doesn't make sense. I'll see what else I can dig up. Yeah. That's a civilian. There's gotta be more to the story. Let me know what you find. Will do. Okay. 
So I think guards now drop meds. Uh, they did before, but I think they changed it to like a pouch. They drop like a mini pouch with uh, some supplies and resources, and I kind of like that. That's really good. Makes it much more clearer for the user and for for the goddamn gamer. Oh, he's out. Good. Remember, I have an advance, so I have to take it easy and not actually get caught. Very nice. Let's keep this going. They drop some ammo and some scale tech. Some scale credits, should I say. Look at the water. Of course, I'm playing on a monitor, folks, but uh, I have it on graphic fidelity because you won't notice the resolution on the monitor. But if you do play on a TV, I recommend putting it... Obviously, if it's in 4K, I recommend putting it on uh, in resolution. Take, you know, take advantage of that uh, large display. And pixels as a whole. All right, very nice. I think we cleared this uh, little compound real quick. Beautiful. Some investigation action right here. Hey, just stop bothering me. Yo, okay. you're bothering me. Don't Shut up. Afraid. Uh, collectible world. We'll go for the residences. You know how to find this place. Can you help? There is one place you might want to know about. Thanks. Much obliged. Still discovering the map as a whole. The map is actually huge, by the way. It doesn't look huge. It doesn't look enormous. Just like uh, Wildlands. Wildlands took ages to explore. The beauty about Wildlands is you could have explored it with a heli just by flying over locations. Here, they've actually included so many more ways of exploring the place. You can do it with a drone, by flying over, by investigating around the place, um, by discovering the world and actually exploring it yourself, which that's what they wanted and counted on um, simply by... You know, they just wanted the user to feel more immersed by actually accessing the game more and more of its actual inner mechanics of, you know, you have to explore this place, otherwise you won't unlock it on the map, which I think it's a great uh, input to include. It's a great incentive as well. Right, uh... I think it's up here. Gotta be right. She's frequently seen around the Parliament's shopping street. She's gotta be one of these mother truckers. I reckon... Okay, I think she's either... Shopping street, so you mean... Okay. 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 I know what we're doing. Which one of you clowns is the woman I'm looking for? Found you. Thank you. Let's go talk to her and let's find a lead. Follow up on one. Damn, they got the tunes up loud. No wonder Sentinel soldiers can't goddamn hear you. Thank you for the freaking favor, folks. Creating diversions and distractions. You love to see that. Please leave me alone. All right, Stephanie. How you doing? Are you Stephanie Burgess? Who are you? You don't look like Sentinel. Name's Nomad. Found your name tied to the Claw Project and an individual known as a strategist. I'm investigating the matter and I have some concerns. Keep your voice down. I don't want people to hear us. Just get out of town. I'm gonna find some place safe where we can talk. With that loud music, I doubt everyone would goddamn hear you, too. When you hear the music, it's so freaking loud. Who turns up the radios these days, huh? Oh, we got clowns. Get down. Alright, very nice. We've got a few vehicles over here. Come on, Stephanie. You better be following me, buddy. Come on, go. Alright, beautiful. Get in the car. Come on, I haven't got all day. They've even, they've even sorted out and smoothened out the driving mechanics. It's so, it's just so amazing how they've done that. People have been asking for this for a long time. It feels lighter, but heavier on the car as, as a whole. It's so much easier to drive. It feels like a bit, a bit like Wild Vance driving, but you better. like an outcast. Are you here to stop Claw? I'm not an outcast. But, yeah, Claw's far too dangerous to stay under Sentinel's control. I'd like to help you, but I can't tell you anything. They have eyes and ears everywhere. Anything I say will be traced back to me. What can I do to protect your safety? I was planning on running away from all of this. But in order to do that, I, okay, need, I need to, to disappear turn here. from Sentinel's database. If you can erase my entire existence from the Sentinel files, I can talk a lot more freely. I'm not trying to be paranoid. It's super important. Just lead me in the right direction. Thank you. I'll give you a burner phone. Call me when you're done. Don't worry. It's encrypted. Where am I headed? There are boats on the shore just west of Liberty City. Take one and you'll be able to reach the naval base. That's where my data is being kept. Thanks. I'll call you when I'm done. 
And will do. It's exactly where I was going. I love... Okay, I love how the ties sync within the sand. Obviously, I knew about this. This was already in an original release game because the details in this game are amazing. They're so extensive, as I've been mentioning so much. But I I'm just... Uh, you're not paranoid. We're on a rower. Everything. You should definitely be paranoid on a rower. I mean, there's dangers in every nook and cranny of the goddamn island. You could die from literally anything. Right. Let's get in that goddamn boat and let's reach naval base. So I can delete uh, all of her details from the actual database so she cannot be tracked anywhere. And she can actually talk more freely with us. Can I jump there? Because I'm going to get I'm gonna get my feet wet right now. <laughs> let's drive the Odyssey. Look at that nice boat. Like it, miss. Seal passage, you see location discovered, you actually have to go to the location to discover it or investigate around the world. Which is a cool feature to add in such a game. Can you hear me? You're coming in loud and clear. Thank you. I guess all this secret agent stuff is a little new to me. Did you have something important to tell me? Oh, yeah. I wanted to share some details about the location. It's an old naval base. Go figure. Inside, there is a data center that keeps a log of all the visitors and VIPs. Any idea of where it is specifically? No, but I know that it's where they keep my profile. It's heavily guarded and equipped with a mortar, automated turret, and drone carrier. It's all very modern. All very useful. Thank you. Okay, thank you for your details, baby. I'm just trying to find a way up here because this clown's literally right in front of me. We'll have to use stealth swim it, I think. Alright, let's get in here. We got some clowns in the AO, ladies and gentlemen. Gotta do this nice and stealthy as the enemy's much more advanced and they can kill us. Luckily, we have a ladder right here. Alright, very nice. Alright, one's definitely big chilling. He's moving. He's hey, moving. Ever wonder how the auto gun turrets work so well? I mean they're freaking lethal, dude. Yeah, but they can't be too hard to disable. <laughs> Their conversations are so they're just literally so plain. And they're just so weird. It's like who teaches you how to speak? You know what I mean? Who taught you how to speak, buddy? Alright, this this goddamn clown is wiped. Love to see that. Now we need to invest use him as an investigation. So we're shooting him in the back. Then we're grabbing this clown if he actually lets me. Grab. Good. Grabbing him out of the goddamn crate. He's apparently glitched into it. Right, interrogate this clown. Tell me, tell me what you got for me. Help Stephanie disappear and she'll share claw secrets. Yes. Could it be in your best interest to tell me about the database's location? It's... It, it's in a building. Northwest part of the camp. Okay, bye, buddy. Right. See you later. Server room. Northwest building. Right, we're gonna Got get it. some pistol kills. So we can get our rank up on the, uh... Oh, hello, how you doing? So we can get our rank up on the echelon. Definitely got some more clowns over here. We can use echelon. Let's go. Marking them all, buddies. Right, it's on the other side of the building. I need to collect a lot of stuff over here, so let's get some pistol kills, ladies and gents. He's out. Love to see that. Nice. Love that. Have a bit of the rank up. Rank 4. I don't know what we can do for rank 4, but I'll keep the pistol out for now. Can't see squad in here. Nice. Love to see that. Let's keep this going. A little pistol action. Got a skill point as well. I'm loving this echelon class. It's so useful. And it's already reloaded. Let's get a new mag in. Lost four bullets out of it. I don't care. I love how, how it's actually getting me to explore the map even more with this new episode. So all of the stuff that I haven't previously... 
took the time to actually, or taking the time to previously explore by myself because you have no incentive to, especially if you're by yourself, if you're a buddy, it's more, it's more understandable to uh, go around and actually explore, but all right, we can use the echelon again. All right, we can remove night vision. We can definitely see up in here. Going for the echelon again. Love that. Got a clown right in front of me. Got some collectible action as well. Buddy, I'm going to need you to climb. Or maybe not. Come on. You can climb that, bud. Come on. Oh, you have to be kidding me right now. Okay. 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 One's coming down. This is no bueno. <coughs> Take it easy. One's on a six. We'll go for the reinforcement guy real quick. I have the uh, sink shot drone, but I'm not going to use it yet. We don't need the breaching uh, torch. We used it in the last episode. I forgot to change it. Go for diversion laws. Love to see it. But for now, we're using our pistol, shock pistol. Uh, I'm going to quickly check what we need to do for the new rank. Let me check this out. Kill enemies with a firearm. Kill enemies while stealth. To kill two enemies with CQC in less than 20 seconds. That's so sick. And we only need once. So we can remove the pistol. We don't need pistol kills anymore. Love that. Let's get a new Megan. Let's make our way on the right side of this compound. Let's try to remove all of these clowns out. Try to take all of these clowns. Won't let me up. Damn. I might be able to cross from here, actually. Can I climb this? Can indeed. Love to see that. And climb this. Love it. Get a P90 out. Need some close range. Unlucky. The body might actually be exposed there. I'm going to have to move it. We'll get a CQC now, but we don't have anyone in range for the next CQC. The next... Uh, we don't have any consecutive target after this. So, unfortunately, we're going to have to... We need two people that are standing right next to each other. Then we can get it. Only that we will be cool. We need them... Not to be grouped up or in a pack. We need them kind of individualized. Like dispersed, but kind of still together. This guy can actually see me. Oh my god, he's a freaking fox. But we need them reasonably close to each other so we can actually make that CQC. And then we'll be able to get that rank up. Because that's probably the hardest one there. All the others are pretty much kills while stealthed. So they're really easy. There's plenty of them that are very much... You know, kind of grouped up. These two, are that's doable, actually. That's very much doable. We need to get there now. ASAP. We need to get there. ASAP. They are very close to each other. That's a very easy one. And there's another one just in case we fail that one as well. Okay, let's check this out. If I divert them, it says in less than 20 seconds, right? So, what I need to do is divert this clown. Looks like we got some fresh meat on it. Come on, clowns, turn around. Oh my god, this is so not good. So not good. Okay, this is much better. I need to take out. I needed to take out these two clowns. Okay, so if we get them or one of them to go over here on the platform, I can definitely make it to the other one. I need them to turn around now. That's it. Where the hell that come from? You go check it out, buddy. All right, I'm with you. Something's up. I know it.
Oh, we need to flashbang him. Uh, still looking. Now, now, now. So far, I got nothing. Beautiful. Nice. We've done it. I think we've done it. Let's check. I think we've done it, though. This must have been it. Let's check it out. Yeah, we've done it. Nice. So, kill two enemies with CQCs in less than 20 seconds. Love to see that. Right. Let's keep this going. We're multitasking this, baby. We're grinding. This is what you love to see. We're vibing and we're grinding. Let's keep this going. That was quite easy. Diversion laws are to play. Diversion laws were money. Wait, wait a minute. I was going to say, I've deactivated. Getting spot. Getting spotted. Okay, good. We'll shock them. They're literally just big chin. Should I waste my... My shock pistol here, folks? Oh, no. They've definitely moved now. Go for a flashbang action. Wait for him to group up again. Come on, buddy. Oh, no. Wait. Not good. Not good. So not good. He's, he's, he's alerting the whole compound. This is really not good. No, they haven't. I'm joking. I've missed my shots. That's just so stupid of me. At least they don't know where we are. This is this might be bad, folks. Just keep cover. Yeah, find him. That's it. You find me. Okay, this is good. This is really good. Go for the head. Easiest way to make a couple grand. Son of a bitch is out here somewhere. I can't see. Hostiles. Okay, he's good. They're good. We're good. We're good. It might be a fight. It might be a little fight. Might be just a little tad fight. Just keep cover. This is good. No, this is not good. This could have been so much better from me. I'm such an idiot. It started off so good and I had ended up missing my shots because I'm such an idiot. It was just going so good. Nice. This guy ball banging me? Oh my god, he just world starred me for the goddamn. Uh... Nice. Damn! This turn up to shits him real quick. It's escalated really quick. Holy smokes. I think that was it. Is that it? Oh my god. No good. I can't hear. What the hell? Why was the turret. Torrent, the turret apparently is freaking silenced. Now it isn't. Okay, this is not good. Beautiful. And the turret's gone. For some reason, the markers still are still on the map, on the mini-map. This uh, happened in the last episode as well. It's a little bug, I think. They're going to have to fix it when enough people complain. And the markers uh, remain on the map even though you've marked them. Unlucky. Alright, that could have gone so much better. I mean, it went pretty good. It's just the, uh, why, why self? You could have got 20 stealthed kills. We could have got all of the stuff we needed. But no, I had to screw it up. We definitely could have got up to at least 20 and then the 5 kill enemies while stealthed. But I'm an idiot. We're definitely going to complete this episode. But still, we could have done it. We could have been working on rank 6 by now. But no, I need to be an idiot. And get caught because I'm an idiot. I'm, go I'm a goddamn clown when I do things like this. Alright, we're well, uh, going to the building on the right real quick. Because I really want to collect. Uh, I want to achieve the collectible real quick. Hello. Going to have a staircase. Thank you very much. Lighting in here is uh, bad. Alright, very nice. Oh, wait, they've got some. Uh, they've got some captives. Where's that cage? Yo, can I go out? 
Is there a, is there an exit? Like a closer one? Maybe. See if I can go on the roof and jump it off. Maybe I can sponge this. Yeah, I can sponge that full, definitely. Or maybe not. Holy smokes. That was bad. Oh, that's all the way up there. That's far. Okay, no, they can stay locked in the cage. That's They shouldn't have got caught in the first place. That's their goddamn problem. Stupid. Shouldn't have been a clown. Goddamn dweeb. See what happens? You got caught. It's not my problem. I still got to show you guys the mass dismantling. You, gotta dis you can dismantle f uh, more than one item. At a time. So useful. Alright, one more collectible. And then... We'll hack the VIP database. Maddox and mind scanning. Here we go. A little bit more on a transhumanism uh, pro uh, topic. Hack. Check the records. Yeah, I'm down. Let's go double check the records. Check Stephanie's profile status. Whereabouts? Okay. Stephanie, I've cleaned the slate for you. You've been scrubbed from the system. Thank you, Nomad. This means the world to me. Think you can talk freely now? Yes. I'm sending you coordinates for where we can meet. Once there, I'll tell you everything you need to know. Beautiful. I'm gonna fast travel to it right now. I will right, we'll fast travel, folks. Ah, uh, where she got damn meeting me? Where are you, Ronda woman, baby? Oh, she's right next to us. Have we got a maybe bivouac nearby? Cause that's that's kind of far. Go. Okay, I'm gonna take the heli in this compound. There's a there was a heli, right? And how do I hell do I get out of here? Okay, we got an exit. Good. And we got a helipad on the left. Beautiful. Would have loved to complete it stealthily, but... Did I waste any of my shock pistols? No, good. Still got enough supplies for another mission. Why are all the heli... Have I shot at the heli? Because I don't remember breaking those windows. No, I don't care, but... Alright, let's go. Yeah, the driving definitely and the flying definitely feels different. It's just so much more smoother. Absolutely loving it. Oh, we got some scale credit accent? Yeah, we do. Some scale credits. And I'm crashing. Where are you? Hello? Where are you? I'm sorry, Nomad. I won't be joining you. I can't. Aw, oh, this is a trap. Why? I have no choice. I need to tie up all of the loose ends. I need you to disappear. Forget we ever met. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. I was gonna say, she's definitely. She. She's definitely played me here. All right, let's get our goddamn rocket. I knew this was a trap. God damn it. So obvious. Unbelievable. You have got to be shitting me. Fuck is that? Oh, they changed the uh, aiming down sight on the rocket launcher. The crosshairs. All right, take that. See you later. How you doing, guys? Wait, are those wolves? They are indeed wolves. Why the wolves? God damn it. Okay. Okay. And we got people coming in on our left. As if this is ever good. I'm getting smoked now. Really? Absolutely smoked. Get down, you clown. Thank you. Oh, that was a shot. Yo, can I, can I shoot this clown? Maybe not. Okay. I'm getting a better position. There's so many. So many right now, folks. And I've jumped down and I've got a minor injury, of course. Because, really, buddy? Can you leave me alone? I'm dying. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Run. Run. Run, buddy. Run. Run, buddy. Thank you. Good. It's much more of a challenge. I did want it this way. All right, let's go move left. Oh my god. Yeah, you're not wrong. 
Very nice. Another one on my right. What are you doing, buddy? I'm gonna push that. What are you gonna do? Bet you are. Beautiful. Let's keep this going. We got some more of the car. Let's try to get to the car real quick. Alright, nice. Is there any more? I'm gonna quickly heal injury. Like this. By using a bandage. We got some meds right here, yeah. That's why I did it. Um, hello? Survive the incoming ambush and leave the error. What do you think I've done? Oh, leave the error. Okay. Make, makes sense. Medkits. Why have I collected a medkit? I don't, I don't, I'm not using medic. Is this game feeling okay? Just stop with this shit, okay? Hey, buddy! I've just been through an ambush. Do you mind? Could you help me? I'm in need of some info. I wish I had more info for you. Thanks, stranger. Thank you. I have a uh, Azure drone flying by. Deep blue. Just gonna do this. Investigating Stephanie Burgess, and I don't like what I'm finding. We need to be careful that she's not tipping off the strategist about our activities. Yeah, let's tread lightly. Speaking of Stephanie, listen. I just interrogated one of the commanders from the claw list. Learned something interesting. Laid on me. Burgess has gotten pretty chummy with his bodyguard of hers, a fellow by the name of Carl Sekulich. As part of Claw's VIP security detail, he probably knows where she's hiding. Carol Sekulich? He's on my Claw list. Yeah, I guess that narrows down who I'll be investigating next. Indeed. So Stephanie led us. Mission completed. Stephanie definitely led us onto a, a bigger lead here. She might be a traitor. She might be tipping off the strategist for us. Lone Wolf, Karol Sekulich. That's exactly who we might be going after next, ladies and gentlemen. We might as well follow it up. Legal move, we've collected. I'm just disappointed in myself how I fell off. Then I couldn't hit a shot for to save my life. And uh, yeah, disappointing episode for me because I'm playing like a goddamn clown. Okay, let's see who we have on the objectives board and let's see who we can go after now. Stephanie Burgess, Karel. Uh, Carol Sekulich, Wolf Commander, which obviously is part of the Wolves, hence why they've just ambushed us. Um, and they do work for Sentinel now because Cole D. Walker is dead. So they work under, uh, they've obviously passed onto the uh, Sentinel branch and under Stone's branch right now. So we could go and follow up some more other leads before actually following up on Carol Sekulich. Follow the Carol Sekulich lead on the strategist and we get the Echelon Mask. The actual full Echelon mask. We actually get the real original Echelon mask. The one that I think... I don't think that's the one that uh, Sam Fish is wearing, actually. It might be. It might be. I don't know. if It's it's definitely from the Echelon series. I don't know if it's that one. Okay, we'll follow this lead up. Um, and we'll see how it goes. with we'll quickly dismantle some of these. Look at the mass dismantle. It's so useful right now. Absolutely loving this. All right, we'll dismantle those. And we get all the parts all in one go. Love to see that. Okay, so... We chow to the bivouac, so we're ready for the next episode. Um, I'm going to leave it there. Uh, we're going to follow up in the next episode. Carol Sekulich, lead on The Strategist. I thought I was going to put it into this episode, but I want to divide it into two episodes. I don't want to make this episode longer. I don't want to go over the time limit, and I don't want to make it confusing for you folks, because if you look at these people, they're all separated into uh, one mission to each, and you also get a different individual piece of cosmetic item of the fourth Echelon uh, unit, or or series, should I say. So I do want to divide these guys for each episode each to not make it confusing for you folks. So I'm going to do Stephanie Burgess, Carol Sekulich, you know how I'm going to do it. It's easy stuff, makes it easier for you guys to uh, understand, makes it easier for myself as well. Um, so folks, we're going to leave it there. Hopefully you enjoyed this episode we found out that stephanie burgies or burgies however you want to goddamn pronounce it uh, the pat the pat uh, patent legal advisor may be tipping the strategist off on our whereabouts and who's actually chasing him now she we don't know who she's working for but she did use us to receive a clean slate on her data she is now wiped off the system wiped off the face of the planet she basically does not exist which is kind of fishy does seem fishy she did promise to talk but in the end we got played like a goddamn fool. We got two time like that. 
easy stuff um, for her and not for us, obviously, as we got an ambush. So hopefully, folks, you've enjoyed it. Smash the thumbs up because I really appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel, and I will see you in the next episode of Ghost Recon Breakpoint, the Deep State Adventure DLC.